it certainly is a dramatic story. One of the babies was born here at UMass Memorial Medical Center. The other baby born in an ambulance on the way here. All of it happening during the biggest blizzard in Worcester's history. This is Aaliyah Sarai, and this is Gabriel Lee. Patricia Strickland of Worcester will never forget the blizzard of 2015. She was 35 weeks pregnant with twins. Monday night, as the storm started raging, she started going into labor. A UMass Memorial ambulance raced through the snow to her home. All the snow gets plowed to my front door. So to get me out there, we had we were slipping on ice. One of the paramedics guys fell. It was crazy. It got even crazier as the ambulance rushed to the hospital. One of the babies just didn't want to wait. A minute later, after my water had broke, I had a, another big sudden urge to push, and my son was like halfway out of me. That was so crazy because I just reached down and I could feel him there. I was like, oh my God, my baby's here. This morning, she told us the wild story with her babies in her arms. I'm open. Hi. Hello. Just as the storm was in the forecast, Patricia says one of her friends predicted this delivery right before it happened. I was like, oh no, don't say things like that. I'm like, you're going to talk it into existence. I always say that. And like an hour and a half later, what do you know? And that's how it happened. That's how the story goes. Patricia's boyfriend hasn't met the twins yet. He had to stay home and watch the older children. They have three older children throughout the storm. But the whole family will be reunited today. And by the way, even though the twins were born prematurely, they are healthy enough to go home within seven days. Reporting live in Worcester, Todd Kiskevich, WCVB News Center 5. Good news. Thank you, Todd. And stay with News Center 5 as we continue to track more snow headed our way. You can find updates 24 7 on WCBB.com and, of course, on the mobile apps.